Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Janita. For those of <laughs> for those of you who don't know me, welcome to Mom with Me. This is my first video. Um, I decided for my first video, I wanted to do something a little out of the norm. I guess you sh you could say because um, when people think first videos, they think introductions, getting to know you, and stuff like that. But I figured I'd do something different. I wanted to talk about some teething must-haves because that is. A question I get asked about a lot a lot of stuff is very inexpensive I think there's just only one item that's I wouldn't say pricey but you know it's worth it other than that um, I am gonna put out there in every must-have video and every recommendation that I ever do a disclaimer almost that these things may not necessarily work for you this is just what worked for us um, I am one of those moms if you're anything like me that I will try anything and everything as long as it'll help my child in whatever it is <laughs> that I need help with at the moment. So let's get started. Oh, what is it they say? If you want to watch TV must-haves, then keep on watching. <laughs> um, anyway, so we're going to start with the raspberry teether. This was a must-have for me when he was four months. It's super easy for him to grab. I don't remember the brand of this. This was probably like $2.99. All of these toys for the most part you can get at Walmart Babies or Us Target um, and Amazon of course Amazon has everything but this was his favorite um, when he was teething on his lowers those were his, the first ones that came out um, so from four months and up even now he kind of still uses it but not as much as he did when he was smaller um, it's super easy to grip it's just like this little bumpy material um, also want to add that none of these toys I put in the fridge or freezer. I just feel like it's not worth it. I don't ever notice a difference on whether I do or don't. I did do it one time and I mean, he acted exactly the same. So I didn't feel like I needed to do that. Um, anyway, that's about it. This one was about two ninety nine. I think I don't have the prices for everything, but I will try to link everything down below. Um, so yeah, that's that. We love that one. Um, the next one. Actually, I do want to add a discla another disclaimer. Well, not disclaimer, but I just want to add it. Um, all of these toys are pretty much newbie toys. That is my favorite brand for teething toys. They make one of the, or some of the best teething toys. So, just want to put that out there so I don't have to keep saying newbie, newbie, newbie. If something's different, I will let The next one, I love this one because it comes with a little carrying case that I don't have in front of me, but I absolutely love that part of it. But, um... Noah really loves this. He loves to grab it. It's super easy for him to grab. Um, yeah, that's about it. Uh, this one was about $2.99, $3.99. They're all super cheap. Um, again, you can find it in all those stores that I mentioned before. But this, he definitely loves it still to this day. He uses it all the freaking time. Like, I literally can give him this in the car on my way back home or on my way to anywhere. And this keeps him so entertained. I don't even need to give him anything else he is super entertained with this so that was a good one this one i bought for him to put in his easter basket it's another newbie one and he started using it when he was maybe like six seven months um and this also is one of his faves like these two are his number ones right now he uses them like he used to use them all the time but these i can literally give him these and he'll be so entertained he won't really pay attention so much of the other ones but these two he loves them so yeah this one again has the little grips that's the good thing about all the newbie toys you'll see that they all pretty much have this little thing and have like some type of toy with this little i want to just say it's like a grip material i don't know i don't know how to explain it but super soothing for the gums he loves that toy this one um the traditional keys i don't want to say that he really uses this one quite often i use this more of an emergency if i can't find any of the other toys um also i don't know if i mentioned it i can't remember but these two i would definitely suggest getting backups of i've probably bought three of these already and two of these because i've lost them and i've needed them so i just learned to have a backup on them almost like if they were pacifiers i get I have tons of pacifiers and he doesn't really care for them but just like i get for those get extra of these because for some reason these always got lost i used to have a dog and he used to bite these and break them and uh, it was annoying so anyway it's always good to have a backup you will know if you're not a mom yet you will find out 
Anyway, this I would suggest, well, not that I would suggest, but I just use these as an emergency. I don't remember if I bought these or if I got them as a gift. I can't remember, but they're good like in a pinch, like when I need to buy the other ones and I don't have them or I can't find them because I don't know how the hell they get lost. But not that he doesn't care for them, but I mean, he doesn't really like them as much as he likes the other ones. <laughs> these two are also backups, um, but he does like these a little bit more than the keys. Um, we always make fun of this one because it kind of looks like a fidget spinner. So everybody says, oh no, I have a fidget spinner. But, um, these are also two newbie toys that he really, really likes. Again, you can find these Walmart, Babies R Us, Target, Amazon for sure. These were probably like $2.99 each. Um, super affordable. But yeah, he really loves these too. These are also ones that I use as backups because I usually try to always make sure that I have either one of these or both of them in the car. But then I also have these separately in case for some reason i can't find these i know that he's gonna take to these so these are also good ones too all of these like i said are newbie brand n-u-b-y um and you can find them anywhere these two i think were about 2.99 3.99 very inexpensive this one is a bright stars brand i just absolutely love this it's a taggy um blanket um it has all these tags on them yeah and then it has these that, you know, they can chew on. I think there's another set here. And he really likes this one too now. Because I just bought this one. Well, didn't just buy it. But I bought it when he was four months. And he didn't really take to it. He's not a, a baby that attaches himself to anything. So he doesn't have a favorite blanket. He doesn't have a stuffed animal that he likes. He doesn't have... He has two other ones. of Not the same, like, taggy style. But, like, the ones that have, like, the little stuffed animal and then the blanket and i always thought that he was going to be attached to something but he's really not i don't know if maybe when he gets older i guess it's a good thing that he's not so that i don't have to be like oh my god if i don't find another one of these and he's freaking freaking out and stressed out he's i'm gonna die you know so i guess it's a good thing but anyway this is also good i just recently noticed that he's starting to take to it more now than he did when i first bought it so um for those of you that don't know noah is 13 months old and yeah just so you know i just think it's super cute too like i just love the patterns it comes in a pink one i believe this one we bought at target um but yeah that's about it that's that one second to last one these are the amber teething necklaces so with the baltic amber teething necklace basically what it is is a fossil uh it is a fossilized tree resin um and basically it contains something called cystinic acid and what it does is once it's placed on the skin and the body's heat it releases the cystinic acid which acts as a natural ibuprofen so it's supposed to reduce inflammation um, help with any pain all you know symptoms of teething basically um, I just heard so many moms swear by this, so I was like, I have to try it because if you're like me, I don't know if I mentioned in the beginning of the video, I try everything and Fernando pleases me every single time. I love him for that because he's never, even though sometimes he thinks like I'm a little over the top because he's like, Johnny, not really, like, do you really need that? You don't really need that. He doesn't really need that. But I'm always like, yeah, we need to try it. We need to make sure that we're not missing anything, you know, whatever. So anyway, everybody swore by this. So I was like, let me so buy it. I went on their website. Oh, I actually went on hazelaid.com. That's hazelaid, H-A-Z-E-L-A-I-D.com. I will link it down below. They're a very reputable site. So I am big on brand name everything. Like I can't even buy like knockoff ketchup. And it's not that I'm bougie. It's just that I have an OCD when it comes to like knockoff brand stuff like some stuff I can do like the knockoff brand but there's just some stuff that I just like well like this for example like this you need to anyway you need to make sure that this is authentic because then it's not gonna work you know so whatever I went on the actual website and I think I paid about $23 for it and then some change and then plus the shipping or whatever the strength is determined by the color so basically the lighter it is the more the more relief it's going to give or the stronger that it is the stronger effect it'll have so i think this is the lightest one if i'm not mistaken i think it was called like the super butter one or something like that it's an 11. they rate them from 1 to 10 1 being 
like the one with the minimal effect and the 11 being like over the top most effective like the strongest one whatever so of course i got the strongest one this one it's for the neck so you put it around the neck usually the closest to the site it is the more effective it's gonna be so i would put it on his well he always wore it every single day around his neck and then at nighttime i would put it around his ankle so what ended up happening was that i noticed that he still was kind of like fussing and not too happy at night so i said let me just leave it on his neck and then just take it off once he falls asleep and that's exactly what i did and i noticed a big difference i noticed that he actually would go to sleep then and not be as fussy so i think i don't want to knock it completely and say it doesn't work because some moms swear by it and i believe that it does work for some children i just feel like for noah it wasn't I can't tell you it was like the greatest thing in the world. Like I still much rather give him this than put this on him. Um, I don't know. I And actually, to be honest, I haven't used it. I After he used it for like the first two months, I stopped using it. I can't even remember why. I would say it's worth it's worth it to buy it, to try it, you know, just to see how your child reacts to it. Um, but I don't think it's a bad thing. I don't think it's something that was a waste of money. I think it did help me for what it is. I mean, it did the job, so. The last one is these. I leave this for last because these are literally a godsend. I absolutely love these. I cannot tell you how many times this has saved our lives. <laughs> um, I'm not too big on Tylenol or Motrin unless I absolutely have to. And to be honest, even when he's in pain, I give him one of these. And literally, I'm not even kidding you, maybe like two minutes after giving this to him, He's fine and he goes to sleep because usually that's what was happening when he got his uppers um, or when he was starting to teeth for his uppers. He had a really tough time at night. So nurse him. I'm 13 months postpartum. He's 13 months um, and I've nursed him since day one. And he, I just noticed that he would be very fussy. He would want to nurse all night or like all the time. And then it, he was just having a hard time falling asleep. So when I noticed that, I would just give him one of these and... Maybe like by the minute or two, he was knocked out. It doesn't put him to sleep. It just soothes them. So basically, they come in this little like foil um, case, case packaging, excuse me. And it's like a whole roll of these um, little carpules. Not carpules, ampules, whatever they call these things. I don't know, this little thingamajigga. Um, and you twist this off and it's basically like water. I mean, I tried it and it tasted like nothing. It tasted like water. Um, and you just give them one. I, I just give them one. I think it says you can do it every 15 minutes if I'm not mistaken. It says repeat as needed every 15 minutes for two more doses. Just don't give more than nine per day. So they're called Camellia homeopathic um, medicine drops. Um, they have all natural active ingredients. Yeah, he did. He'll be okay. Anyway, these are godsend. I got these. You can find these at Babies R Us. Um, but I buy mine on Amazon because they're a little cheaper. And um, like I said, you can't... You can find them at Babies R Us, but I think I've checked a few and only one carries them. And it's like once in a blue. And I think they're like $2 more expensive at Babies R Us than on Amazon. So I just get it on Amazon. Um... But yeah, I absolutely love this. And that's it. Those are all the teething items that I have for Noah that I swear by, especially this. Oh my God, go get this right now. This is definitely a must buy. Um, thank you so much for watching. That's it. That's all I have for you today. I'm sorry for the crazy looking video. My lighting is horrible. I'm in my dining room. Um, I had to do this at nighttime. This is going to be the only time that I can film when Noah's sleeping and he's actually up. So I got to go and get my baby but thank you so much for watching please subscribe like leave in the comments down below any suggestions you have for future videos for me and i will see you in my next video good night well good night right now but bye